The people in attendance during today's service was special assistant to President Biden, Greg Jackson. Now, Jackson is the deputy director of the president's office of gun violence prevention. He spoke to our Claudine Ewing about what has changed since the top shooting and what the Biden administration thinks still needs to be done. We have to figure out how do we make sure that we get to them before tragedy strikes, whether that's with resources and support or whether that's with accountability, you know, removing the firearms from their home, making sure they don't have the tools to execute this. And that's one of the major changes we made. We added a new background check to make sure that if you're under 21, we check your mental health records and your juvenile criminal history records before you're approved to buy a gun. Jackson says since that went into effect, more than 2,400 people have been denied access to a gun.